It is December 25th, 2022. Merry Christmas to you. Um, even though I don't celebrate Christmas the way I used to anymore, uh, it still felt a little weird flying and traveling today on Christmas Day. I came from Bangkok to Phuket. I am staying at a different hotel in Phuket. It is called Sea Lord Hotel. And I just checked in and perfect timing because look at my view. First of all, I do have to work. See, Sunday, December 25th, 6.07 p.m. And that is my view. Yes, I did travel here for work. Um, the, I will be here for about a week. I don't know when I will post this video. I won't post it today on December 25th, but I think we should have the Christmas spirit every single day of the year, not just December 25th. I think we should practice giving and receiving and love and kindness and compassion every single day of the year, not just during the holiday season. I came up to the water so you can get a better view of the sunset. I will be posting pictures of the sunset, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, Julia said his journey. Be sure to go there and check out lots and lots of pictures of the sunset and everything else from my journey. I wish you a very, very Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, um, Happy Winter, whatever it is that you celebrate from Thailand. Thank you so much. I'm gonna show you a quick clip of the room this time it is a villa and it's a two bedroom villa because I am sharing the room with somebody else from work who uh, came out. So you'll see two bedrooms in there. I got the master bedroom because I arrived first. <laughs> so enjoy, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and I will see you again. I cannot believe that I forgot to wish my teacher friends a happy winter break. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy your two weeks off. If you have more than two weeks off, hooray for you. Have a restful, restful winter break. Reset, rest, rejuvenate, whatever it is that you need to do. Happy winter break, teacher friends. Oh, and look at my shirt. Love all, serve all. Love all, serve all. Love, 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 love. I got this from Hard Rock Cafe two days ago. I was in Bali like two or three days ago and now I'm in Phuket. <laughs> so love to all. It's so fitting. I love this shirt. Love to all.
Isn't my room so pretty? It's so cozy. Thank you to my job for putting me up in such a lovely, lovely, comfortable, comfortable resort. It's like a bungalow. Um, here is my walk down to the beach. Enjoy it. I knew I would not be posting this video on December 25th. It is now January 1st, 2023. Yay! Happy New Year, everybody, everybody, everybody. If you are Thai, happy 2566. Thais um, have a Buddhist era calendar that they go by. So happy, happy New Year, wherever you are in the world. I am still at this resort. It is, you know what, I gotta tell you, it is New Year's Day, 10.35 in the morning. And I came out here about 9.30 to have my morning coffee on the beach, my Starbucks cup, have my morning coffee on the beach like I always do every day, put on my makeup every day on the beach, and there's no, there was nobody here at 9.30. I think they were all still sleeping. It's now 10.30 and there is still nobody here. Let me show you my view. Here I am. And there's the beach. They put up those kites yesterday. Nobody. I'd walk out there and show you guys, but I'm just really chilling right now. And I'm not getting up from this chair. Oh, I got new hair. <laughs> My hair is forever changing, so I do have new hair. It is much, much lighter. If you have been following my journey, you know that um, I cut and color my own hair. And uh, part of the reason is because it is like lost in translation. Um, when I lived in Indonesia, they didn't speak English, so I couldn't find anybody to cut my hair. So I just started doing it myself. And I have been doing it myself now for, you know, four years. But... Uh, it is my cut yesterday. They colored it, keratin treated it, and um, highlighted it. And uh, it's almost, almost perfect for me. I would like more uh, lighter roots. So when the grays grow in, it's blended more. I have a video of me actually um, coloring and cutting my own hair. So go back and take a look at some really... <laughs> It's a hidden talent of mine that I have is just doing my own hair. <laughs> so new year, new me. But it's also a new me on the inside. I don't want any of you guys to say new year, same me. I said this last New Year's. You do not want to be the same you. If you are the same you, you are telling yourself that there's no room for growth. There's no room for learning. There's no room for opportunity. You don't want to be the same you. You want to be every single day you wake up, a new morning, new you. Your birthday year, new birthday year, new you. New Year's Day, new, new Year's, new you. Continue to strive to grow, to be a better version of you, a higher version of you, a higher vibrating version of you. New Year, new you learn, grow, transform, become continuously, continuously, continuously. Um, last night I, 
uh, celebrated New Year's alone. <laughs> surprise, surprise. <laughs> I celebrate everything alone. Every I celebrate Monday alone, <laughs> Saturday alone. Um, but you know, it, it's I'm I'm rarely ever ever lonely, even during these holiday times. And you know, it's it's really because I I have this inner acceptance of myself. I have this inner peace. I have this um, this 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 inner health. And and I continue to work on it every every single day. As a matter of fact, if you are watching this video, and if you are interested in receiving coaching from me um shoot me a message shoot me leave a comment uh privately dm me on facebook instagram uh julia said his journey you know if, if i will help you guys go through this we can discuss the details when you dm me but i am here for you i think in 20 because you know being out here in phuket for the holidays um i had a lot of alone time and i you know last night i was like oh wow there's a bar across the street it's just a little like a dive but it's a tiny bar they're playing some kick-ass music people were dancing and having fun and i'm like oh i would love to go over there but i just wanted peace and quiet so what I did, you guys, was I had dinner on the sand. It was like a picnic dinner on the sand by myself. There were families at the restaurant where I always eat at. I've been eating at this restaurant every single day for the last eight days that I've been in Phuket. And I didn't realize that on New Year's Eve, I needed to make a reservation. So all of the tables were booked. So I said, that's okay. They know me. I said, that's okay. I'll just sit on the ground and eat dinner. I ate dinner on the grounds by myself. After dinner, I, it was a big dinner too. I was so hungry. Um, after dinner, I took my towel and I went and just laid on the beach under the stars. I can't see stars in Bangkok. Under the stars, under the moon, quietness away from everybody else and just kind of like reflecting. Of course, I'm crying as I'm reflecting from 2022 and just being so, so grateful of, of everything, everything, everything that the external world has provided me, everything from internal, just every one, every moment, every experience. I went back through my um, photos and my calendar. I was going back and forth, back and forth between both apps, and I'm like, Ah, oh, shit, God, I did so much. I saw so much. I became so much. I was a part of so much, you know? And then I hear people who I may or may not know on a personal intimate level, you know, just commenting and thanking me and following me and, you know, telling me that I've inspired them. And, and I'm so, so glad to have done so. And I know that 2023, 2022 was just the beginning. 2019 was the beginning when I left the States. 2020 was great for me because, oh my gosh, it talked about a learning experience in 2020. 2021, another great year. 2022, man. Oh. Wow, 2022. I have, you know, pictures again, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, um, more videos on YouTube for my 2022. I just made the most beautiful video of my sunset in 2022. Please go back and take a look at those, at that video. It, it just amazing, amazing. So going back, <laughs> if you are interested in receiving some coaching with me, um, I will be more than, more than happy to help guide you and teach you and be your cheerleader and coach you i will have three options um, and three different price ranges the first option is a one-on-one -on -one, private the second option is a group small group session now i'm a teacher small group means three to five so if you can find three <laughs> unless you work in pinellas county schools small group may mean seven or nine but it's really supposed to mean three to five. 
So small group, three to five, if you have friends or family that you want to grow with and you want them to grow with you, um, I will have that option for a small group uh, opportunity for learning and growing and uh, transforming and becoming. I will also have a mix if you want to do small group and receive personal one-on-one. -on -one. So please shoot me a message. I am here for you. I'm here to serve you. I am not an expert by any means because I am still learning. You know, none of us are. On this life of journey, nobody's an expert. Um, but I am here to share what I have learned. I am here to serve you um, through whatever it is that you need to go through, whether it's just listening and talking. Um, so let me know, let me know. I have to give a thank you, a true thank you to God and the universe and um, everything else in my life, the people, the places, myself. That is like step number one, you guys. You got to thank yourself as well because you are the one who woke up in the morning and put on that smiley, happy face, even though you may not have wanted to put on a smiley, happy face. You are the one to get yourself out of bed. You are the one to punch that time clock. You are the one to feed your kids. So thank yourself first and foremost. Well, thank God in the universe. Then thank yourself second and second most. <laughs> so I will leave you with, because I'm already at 10 minutes and um, my first video was, I think, six minutes or something like that. I will leave you with some beautiful sunsets with my experience in Phuket um, for the last eight days. I wish you guys the best year, new year that you've had so far. Um, I wish you guys love and abundance for a new year and a new you. Um, I say this often. I realize that my lifestyle is may not be the lifestyle that you want. It is the lifestyle that I want, but I wish and I pray and I um, emit into the universe abundance for you. Whatever your type of abundance is, I do wish that for you. So I am going back to Bangkok tomorrow. It's okay. This is like a deja vu because I remember saying this before. I go back to Bangkok tomorrow and I'm like sad and pretend to be crying. And then I'm like, um, but that's okay. <laughs> it is quite all right. I know that I will be back. Um, I, before I go, I know I'm at 11 minutes, but before I go. So I made a video when I was at Andaman, um, Andaman White Beach Resort. And I was like on the beach and I made a comment of um, how somebody once told me that I could never have a house on the beach because it was too expensive for me and I couldn't afford it. But although uh, my work put me up on that beach, on that resort, which was like on the beach, I had, remember that video where I had my private pool. And um, I got to tell you, this resort, I am closer to the beach. And I, when I showed you that clip, I, I would just walk down a set of steps and I can see the ocean from my room. I can hear the waves every night I'm sleeping from my room. I am getting closer and closer to living on the beach. When I mean living, it's, it's not a house that I bought by myself. It's um, my living that I'm, I do when I'm here. Like I lived here for eight days. So that's kind of living that I'm saying. But you guys, one day I will be owning a house on the beach don't know where in the world, <laughs> but it's not a coincidence. It is not a coincidence there, you know, start looking at and noticing and observing the little things that happen. And you don't even have to wonder why just accept it. I see you. Thank you. And I welcome it. That's all you need to say, you know, um, it's remarkable. So anyhow, uh, I will leave you with some beautiful clips of the sunset. Thank you. Thank you so much for another fantastic year of 2022. Thank you for being on this journey with me since 2019. If you're new, 
welcome i know i'm talking really really fast and i don't really like to talk this fast um for my non-native english speaking viewers and friends but uh i i am already at 13 minutes so thank you again for watching thank you for being with me it's been a hell of a ride and i don't intend to slow down and i don't intend to um stop i intend to keep moving forward i intend to keep appreciating keep um the humility keep being grounded but at the same time i do intend to keep receiving and creating and accepting the abundance as should you so i will finish my coffee now walk on this deserted beach by myself because nobody is up and i think it's like after 11 now and enjoy my day my first day of 2023 happy 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 new year friends love to all I knew I would not be posting this video on Jan. Blah, 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 blah.